Yo, and then how's it going? The finale of My Colors has finally come and gone, and honestly, it's actually pretty interesting as to how this actually kind of plays out, because the most interesting thing of all is that Rue is still around, and we actually do get to see, like, like that, um, like, like what actually inspired her creation for, for Haruhiko, so... And apparently it started all the way back when he was a kid and his mother read him this this like Aladdin fairy, fairy, uh, fairy tale book which is why she gets her design and honestly why she's been been with him for so long there's also very little <laughs> even though you know it's like that this entire episode revolves around um, Enigma pretty much kind of having the same origin as Mewtwo except for being a little more you know Instead of instead instead of her being being cloned, she she was more of a guinea pig and stuff like that. And I will be fair, it did actually seem like that when um when uh she did lose her and say her and her and Haru, they they did kind of have somewhat of a minor connection, you know. And you know, even though that did kind of come off a little bit sad, but at the same time, she did kind of steal his powers and try and murder him, though. So, you do kind of, well, actually, she didn't try to murder him. Uh, well, she did now, but, but like, before, she, she just took his powers and left, because she really didn't want to kill him and stuff like that. But, still, you know, you kind of can see that they had somewhat of a tight uh, relationship, you know, with her playing his mother and him following right up, um, and him following right up right up behind her and playing like the apathetic son and everything of course but how but of course Haru he does get his powers back and how he gets his powers back is that he has to kiss Ruru which which who who isn't acting like her self-confident um uh, um uh, her confident self she's acting more she's acting a lot more like like Haru now and way more polite and way more and way more um outgoing which is actually really crazy, which is something that a lot of them that, that they do like, but of course, you know, with that, honestly, after like he unlocks like his latent powers from, 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 uh, from, from Ruru, I swear he seems to turn into like one of the most OP characters, like right up there with like Koito's level of like, of, uh, of, uh, of power, especially with his summonings and the two in which that he already has. It's like it's not a puppy no more, and it's not a very cute and car twenty octopus anymore. These things actually come out looking way more devious and way more evil than what, or at least way more power, powerful than 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 what they normally were. Because like even in their like cuter forms, they were still powerful, or at least Cthulhu was, and um, and now they're pushed past whatever that that was, and now they're. They're strong enough to like just mow down like every single one of her attacks, attacks that that she has stolen with a little with with little to no effort. Even going so far as to even upgrade his like binding abilities um, of the trough thing, so that so that he doesn't even need to have his notebook anymore. He 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 can just sort of create a barrier now and just sort of like just have white white light 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 come out and just sort of bind them like like that honestly it feels as though as that that they've upgraded his character to something to something that probably could stop just about every single fandom in which that that ever comes his way ever again but honestly the plus side to that is though is that every fandom can't be beaten the the uh the uh, exact same way so so it's a nice personal advancement for Haru but not necessarily like a overall thing so of course it ends the way how you think it does he meets his mother gets in good good with her um actually kind of gets his mother back his friends they all look out for him for like for like this entire episode and honestly it answers just about every question the only the only thing that i kind of have to say about this though is that i actually wish that this was the entire series i wish that these last two ep that 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 these last two episodes was something plastered over more than just two episodes it was like the it's probably like episode four on to 12 or maybe three on uh three on to 12 because this could have been a very interesting like story plot for this entire 
um, series to where is that you have somebody who is Enigma going going around stealing other people's powers and then and then they have to slowly try and find or stop her and gain those abilities back, which is which could have been a lot, uh, which could have been a very interesting and very long, um, long fart story. But but honestly, for what it is, I still accept it and it's still nice. But until then, I'll see you next time on the next John Grave Show. Please keep watching anime, keep playing video games, and tell me what you think about this down in the comment section. Um, hey, internet, how's it going? Did you like that video? Go ahead and click. Click over there up on the side and go ahead and check out way more of my videos and go ahead and show me all this crazy, crazy, crazy support. Important, which I know that you would love to give me, and I'm very, very, very happy about that. Also, for those out there who pretty much love to read, go ahead and check out this book right here. It's called Ibarra by my good friend Deshaun R. Smith, and also my books in the back of this, or at least the prologue anyway. And that uh, and that book is called Noir Prophecy, a ghost story about about ghosts and whatnot. Also check out our other book, Mizuki Lineage of the Dragon, and uh, and also our very first book, Mizuki Dragon Warriors Volume One. So yeah, go ahead and click on down there in the description. Go ahead and check that out, and pretty much you will get taken to Amazon where you can purchase this this wonderful beauty. So yeah, until then, I'll catch you next time. I'll see you next time, and thank you for all the uh, support. I'm out.